Hi all, let's see how to implement PyChart dynamically in ASP.NET Core or MVC application using Chart.js in C-Sharp. Let's see, here created a ASP.NET Core MVC application. Inside the controller created a hook controller and here created a view in the name Py. Let's open the view. Inside this view created a div with the class name text center card card header. These divs are optional but to create a div where you want to show the chart and inside the div create a canvas tag with the id attribute provide any name which you want here I gave pie chart. Then we have to provide the jQuery and chart.js file link. Here I provided the CDN link for jQuery and chart.js. You can also download this file and import that file link also. And inside the script tag, get the element for canvas tag by id and assign it to the variable and create a chart function. Inside the chart function, provide the variable name and mention type as pi. And inside the data property, provide the label values. Here I hard coded the label values. Let's see how the chart looks like in this hard coded values. Then I will show how to change this value dynamically. Then inside the data property, provide the data points and the background color for each data point. And inside the options, provide font size, font color, box width, etc. Let's execute and check. Here our pie chart. We provided five data points. So five data points are showing here. Now we are hard coded the values. Let's make it dynamically by passing values from controller. Let's start debugging. Go to controller for creating a list. Uh, created a model for student score detail inside model folder. Let's open that. Inside this model, created three properties, ID, name and score. Let's create a list for this model. Here I added values manually, but in real time, take values from database. Let's return this object to view. Let's go to view. Let's import the model. Here we want a label and data points dynamically. Let's create two variables. name let's push values from model to this array variable by using for each pushing name into student name array and the score into score array let's change the score as post then add the student name array into label and score into data property let's execute and check Here our pie chart which is displaying values from control. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.